Hello. This is Forehead. Portal 2 Let's Play Episode 10 Lemons Phone. Well. Here we are. The surprise! Alright, so a new chapter, I guess. Good thing I didn't jump into the elevator until the start of this episode. Uh, uh, uh. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. Gasp. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Uh, that is so low. Of course, I was implying that uh, in the last couple episodes, like, I didn't know who she was talking about, but I think it's pretty obvious. It's like she's gonna reunite you with your parents, but she does not. Laser, be careful. Even though they can't really kill you. Uh. Let's see, right. So I need to get over there. And here we go. Oh, two cubes. That does a whole lot of good, doesn't it? good, it all works. Everything is fine. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's put those over there. And follow it. And we should burn that guy. Problem solved. I feel awful about that surprise. You're right. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. To those parents who are trying to reach, do not love you. Please hang up. Oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. That voice is so human like. That is saddening. How's it going? I talked my way onto the old Nanobot work crew rebuilding this show. They are really small to oh. I know, Jerry! No, I'm on a break, mate. I'm on a break. And ah! Just hang in there for five more. What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Okay. Apparently, uh... Yeah. Well, you Never know mind. the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. Uh, that is probably one of my favorite lines. It's a good one to use when cheering people up. Especially if they've played Portal and actually get the reference, otherwise they just kind of look at you funny. I don't think I caught that in time. Oh, 
I did not bring a cube up here. Ah, da, 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 da. Let's grab that one. So even though there's a dot over there that says, like, kind of implies you should go over there first, it's lying. That's where you should point the laser first. I love how enormous and intimidating this room looks, and you can, like, get caught up in trying all these things, and you're like, I don't know where to start, but then you just go over to the laser and actually start doing, and you're like, huh, follow the path, okay. It's not that difficult, really. thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Seems like a fair solution. At least she's honest. Although not usually. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right. 20. The facility is completely operational again. Hooray! That was, uh, that was a pretty sweet bounce. When I was playing around with the developer tools, I frequently looked at this room and all the textures for, like, inspiration. Because I wanted to make maps that looked complete and whole. So, I look at stuff. The general feeling that I was getting is that they would use as large as possible and then fill in the small bits with smaller ones, but sometimes not. Like, this floor is pretty, um, not enormous, so... Just a lot of variation, I guess. Kind of hard to uh, really make sense of the style. It's not like a formula. It's art, which is difficult for me because art is not perfect ever. It's like the point of it. Uh, da, da, da. The 
first time I tried uh, doing you know, like this for some reason. And I was like, this is impossible. But that's just because I'm stupid sometimes. Test chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Uh, yeah, that's the dynamic music. It's really, really cool, and usually less. I've got a surprise for one. you after this next test. Not a fake. Tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. And real confetti this time. The good stuff. Our last bag. Part of me is going to miss it. But at the end of the day, it was just taking up space. Uh, lovely mentality. Um. The music is generally less easy to spot than that, but the idea is that it's like people can almost compose their own music and will play certain melodies and stuff when you accomplish a certain part of the puzzle, so each step of the process that you solve will start a different piece of music. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I remember reading an article about it. It was cool. Um... I've been sitting in this room forever because I'm going to end it here. I will see you later. Do what you normally do. Bye.